Hello everyone, what's up? Man, I'm Shane, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, Wow! And we're down to two more episodes after today's episode, of course. Yay! Finally! Well, yeah, let's just say we're now, right now, at the Holy War. Yes, guys, the Holy War started. And we're down to like two more episodes. Well, actually, three episodes of concluding today, of course. Well, let's just say, I do wonder how would it end this season three. Because I'm pretty sure they won't just like destroy all the chapters and just get to the main part of the holy war i'm pretty sure they want to go with the proper pacing you know they want to piss off a lot of fans so yeah i do wonder how they get into season three though rather than end in a very cliffhanger way like they did for season two or they'd rather end it like in a very stupid way to get us all pissed off and there will be no more season four so and just force us to read the manga of course so yeah let's just say last episode king Oza was unlucky he, he his mind is being possessed by the one of the demon commanders after all so you know he got you know he spat he stabbed his own cell because of the you know seppuku and stuff like that and of course merlin was kind of sad about it because you know she really adores author and of course you know jealousy from um Escanor and stuff like that you can see you can pretty much guess what's going to happen between him and you know merlin near future events but yeah let's just say the holy war sorry that's basically the message from last episode so everyone's like prepared to fight against this demon mediator to absorb all the commandments and while well, Escanor's looking around for all the commandments so yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure we're right now at the midst of the Holy War right now. But the thing is, how would it end the season? That is the question because we're only down to two more episodes after today's episode. I don't really see that they're gonna end it, you know, end the Holy War in one go. They, I think they're gonna go for the proper pacing. I hopefully it's a cliffhanger ending. Although season four is unlikely because of how they dealt with season three by D Studio Dean. So who knows how they end the season? And of course, you know, maybe they end the season in a very cliffhanger way to get us reading the manga, which is. Very very likely of course. So yeah, without further ado, let's get cracking the reaction, shall we? Well, at least it did quite well with the animation of the blast firing at demons. I mean, at least I think this is like a part of a very important arc, so that's why maybe the Sunni Dean decided to do well with this fight scene right here. Although it still looks um oh ho ho damn. Aha, there we go. Warning from the, the villagers to leave immediately before the holy world get the grasp of this whole land. And they're too late. Aha, look at the, the castle defense team, man. Aha, not bad. Not bad indeed. Well, you know, some weird looking animation, but it's still it's quite nice from Studio Dean. Oh, so they're heading to Camelot. Oh, damn. Straight to the battlefield. The main battlefield. Holy shit. Here we go. I mean, obviously there will be a lot of casualties since, you know, the thing's thinking that's demons after all. Wow, okay, he's gonna charge straight up. Oh, I mean, of course he got the holy blessing from the angel, so he's more confident than ever before. See? Ha <laughs> ha Oh ho ho! Ow! Ouch! And is he, like, dead? Wow, okay, so he's not hurt from it. Oh, of course, holy blessing. Oh, okay, so the Archangel gave them cheat hope, so power, the power them, uh, make them feel like they have strong, but in the end, they're hurt like badly inside. Okay, so they gonna, if they keep up this up, they're gonna die. <laughs> wow, the defense goes so well, man. Everyone, everyone is dying, basically. Holy shit. Dude, the demons are just a bit too strong for them, man. Jesus Christ, the demons are basically massacring everyone, man. Dude, this is one-sided. This is a bit too one-sided. Oh, look at Diana, man, summoning the ground. Yo, ho, ho, wow, Diana. Damn. Oh, now that is what I call ground serving. And there goes King, summoning his gigantic spear. Ha <laughs> ha look at the seven daily sins at work, man. This is why you're, you're quite lucky to have them in the battlefield. <laughs> Damn, there's more coming. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, of course, the Archangels. Aha! Yeah, she's gonna evacuate those two, and she may be caught in the middle of a blast or something. <coughs> well, me at least they're chilling around, like they're not involved in the war. <laughs> oh, okay. So she wants to return her commandments. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, shit! The worst comes to worst has arrived. Yep, he has found them. Oh shit! And he's really willing to kill them without mercy. Oh yeah, she Elizabeth did save them from, after all, so maybe she 
taking to a liking that you know things are not the way it is now you know who are and she decided to like fight with she just to like, give up on this now okay why not i guess oh shit oh there she goes oh no yeah she kind of missed the battle and she became a victim of it uh and she's dead oh fuck the i mean <laughs> Kind of started coming anyways, but oh my god, this is bad. This is bad, man. Wow, look at him being all cocky because he's like the special one, man. He and her, of course, the gang too, being very cocky, man. <laughs> because of the cheat hope. Oh my god, look at him, man. Just thinking, he's like, what he's saying is kind of like stupid, but no, he's basically being the, the very dense one. Exactly, you are the dense one. Elizabeth, what she's saying right now is true, and he doesn't really care. But now, luckily, the archangel is on her side. Exactly, shut the fuck up, man. She's been not only being com com uh, communicating with demons, but she could also use using her magic, maybe. Exactly. Of course, that's her main magic, healing. So she's been healing everyone on Channelly like throughout the whole game, the whole war. Well, well, well. Look like Elizabeth managed to lecture them quite nicely. How nice of her to do something like that. Mm-hmm. Nice one, Elizabeth. Nice one. Of course she's angry. Of course she's angry. Because she just hurt- She just killed someone that took care of them. Of course. She has become soft. This is what happened. Of course, eating the soul is a thing for them after all. Oh! Hey! Save- Save the soul by switching the apple. Ha 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 ha! Well, you know, his magic is switching- Um, performing magic after all. <laughs> well, luckily enough, she's safe now. Yeah, her soul is safe. Oh, oh, god! He got caught, caught in his chokehold. Oh my god! Really, man? Of course, he's here to kill them too. So he, there's like no running away from them. Exactly. Yeah, he doesn't really care either that you know they're gonna return the thing or something. Exactly. He really needs to take all the commandment for himself. He's that sort of person after all. He's a greedy person, and he's gonna kill him. Oh, what the fuck just happened? Oh, holy. Yo. The, yo, whoa. He just switched place with him. Oh, wow. Look who's with the one being choked. Damn, his magic is, switch, is switching out indeed. <laughs> oh, my God. So he's just waiting for the right moment to like make switch with him. <laughs> look who's with the laugh, one laughing now. Oh, oh, did he just self destruct? Holy shit. Hey. Guess that didn't even affect Mon Speed because. Oh, guess Mon Speed is like really good fire. Ha 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 ha. There's no escape from it. Oh, okay. So apparently, Asgunner has a vet. He has a, not so much dark energy back in when he was a kid. And apparently, be given the dark, the dark energy by the father, he became twisted like this. Um, interesting backstory, I guess. Well, at least he knocked him out cold. Wait, what Yao, dude? D dude, what Yao, man? Hey! Oh my, dude, you, un dude, un you underestimated him. Oh, oh, he did not just switch place with her. Oh my god, and blasted her away. No! Oh god! Really? And you haven't told her about you how you're feeling too. Hey, and there he goes, self-sacrifice. Although I don't think he's enough to kill Ascanor, though. But at least he did his his part. Well, okay. What a sad way to end episode twenty-two. Mosquito dying just to protect her. I mean, protecting the person that he loved after all. So that's like a romantic and tragic, of course. So we have a tragic romantic end to this episode today. Well, the thing that Mos uh, Mosquito talked say about you know Escarno's past is something very strange though because like he said he was born, he doesn't have dark energy, so he gave him the commandment and then he, he became a twisted person and because he had been looked down upon by his uh, father and because and stuff like that. So yeah, okay, interesting. So he doesn't really have the dark demon side of thing back when he was a kid, and he's being a very uh, soft person too. But in the end, he got given the power. By the father, and that's what he became right now—a very twisted person. Hmm, interesting backstory. 
Hopefully, it, it just plays some big part in later in the episodes too. But yeah, in the end, you know, mosquito, uh, mosquito was so close, man. But dude, you you know, Ascano, he's faking his death, man. You you just walk right into a trap. Seriously, come on, man. Dude, it's it's a no brainer. You need to. Oh God. So in the end, he died protecting her, and he got his command taken now. Oh my God! Seriously, man, she she let her guard down. Seriously, but I don't want to say that at least some of the the scene to this episode, the fight scene, looks okay actually compared to like the previous episode and stuff like that. I mean, the fights, the blast from the demons, and of course the fight between uh must must be on Escanor. Although it was pretty much cut short to the choking scene only, but. Yeah, I mean, Studio Dean did the best with some of the the, the scene in doing the Holy Grail, Holy War, but but I would say that still it's still kind of lacking in some aspect. But you know, at least they have some sort of visual to it. Although I would say that um, so the scene where the villager died, I, could, I think it could have been more you know more eerie how she died rather than you know turn black, her whole body turn black and something like that. But I mean, that's just my preference to how it makes her situation death look more tragic. But you know, her her death is pretty much like being turned black. I was like. Really? That's it? I was expecting more from Escano, like maybe burn her away or something like he did in the, to the to those two. Um, but yeah, it seems like the um, you know with the seven deadly scenes around and of course with the Archangel around, it seems like they can do well during the Holy Holy War. While um, um you know uh, Merlin and the rest and uh, the big boys goes directly to Camelot to face off against Meliodas. Or should I say Zeldras and the two masters after all? I mean, since Meliodas is like currently in um, hibernation to uh, to become the Demon Lord. So yeah, let's just see how the next uh, next two episode goes and see how we end the season. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Actually, today give like questions. Success, 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 success,